Hey guys and welcome to my channel. In today's video, we are here at the world famous Kandalim Beach in North Goa. I'm going to be showing you guys the beach. I'm going to show you guys the streets of Kandalim. I'm going to show you guys the crowds. As you can see, the shacks are being built up here. So I'm going to give you guys the complete update about the shacks, the water sports prices. I'm going to tell you guys about the beach bed prices, everything possible. So let's go and check out this beautiful beach here in North Goa. Okay guys, so we are right now in the middle of the Kandolim Road here in North Goa and I'm showing you guys the streets just before we go to the beach. I want to show you guys the crowds and everything that's happening here. As you can see, there's quite a lot of hustle and bustle as season has started already here in Goa. So Kandolim, it's a beautiful day today and I'm just showing you some of the restaurants and places here. So. If you look around, there's quite a lot of crowd, but such a beautiful day. Look at the shopping and everything that's here. If you see here, there's quite a few tourists that are here. And you will also see there's a lot of international tourists that have come in already. So as we go down further on the road, we will find many, you know, international tourists walking around, especially like, for example, here, if you see, because Kandolim is like a very famous spot for international tourists. and yeah, so I'm going to give you guys an update about the shacks. Many people keep on asking me have the shacks opened up. But before I tell you about the shacks and show you guys the shacks, of course, I'll take you to the beach. But I just want to tell you about the weather. So it rained for a couple of, I mean, it did, rained for one day. And when it rained, you know, the skies completely changed. The weather suddenly became nice and cool. So right now it's not that hot, humid air anymore. It's nice and cold right now not cold in the sense it's pleasant very pleasant right now and if you look on at the sky you have beautiful white fluffy clouds now which just makes goa even more beautiful so if you see here like compared to my last videos there was very less people before but now there seems to be quite a lot of crowd come in of course it's not like the you know december crowd but still it's pretty decent for right now and it's around i think uh, 11 30 in the morning but let me just show you guys here so just to give you guys a uh, idea of like the crowd hi guys so yeah there's like a lot of international people that are here at these restaurants here if you see this is the famous mango grove restaurant here and there's like people everywhere hey what's up Moses. how Moses? yes Moses. hi how are you how are you where are you guys from Really? Where are you guys from? England. Okay, wow. So you're in the video today. I'm coming back in a while. I'll come and say hi. Yeah? Bye. See you. So we have viewers here. So they are from England. Very nice to see because, you know, I have so many viewers from England. So if you are from England, please drop a comment down below. This is the Newton supermarket here on the left. This is Vado here. And wow. Goa looks so beautiful with the sky today. So this is tomatoes in just a while, like like 12, 30 onwards, this place will be completely full. So this is uh, the main road that we are going down to the beach from here. So this is of course the shopping here that's available. Let me just take you guys and show you guys a little close up of the shopping here. So this is the shopping area. And of course there is shopping on both sides of the road and see there are people everywhere so you know uh, it's still early so most probably people are on the beach already but yeah so nice to see that you know there's international tourists there's local tourists there's everything that's opened up here see the bars here people having beer early morning well it's early morning for me but yeah for, <laughs> for you know most of the people who are here on holiday it's the start of a nice uh, day here so yeah we, what we are going to do is i'm going to just park up ahead in a while but i'm just giving you a complete tour this is j3 club by the way if you want entry here to the club i'm just going to show you guys so this is the entry rates here so you have you can go for you know clubbing here in the evenings uh, of course late evenings but if you see here the crowd has started to increase so yeah I'm just giving you guys a complete tour of all sides. So this is my new camera, guys. Uh, please uh, drop a comment and tell me what you think about, you know, the 
quality of the video hopefully it is good so what i'm going to do is let's get out of this traffic yes good morning so everybody is smiling there so wow look at this restaurant so this is a really nice restaurant here azura uh, i'm going to be doing a full vlog of azura in just a while and you know one of these days and show you guys like what is the scenes from here but if you see good morning so here we have tia and if you see the restaurant also is quite a few people inside here so i'm just getting stuck in traffic oh my gosh i hope this truck doesn't bump into me so good morning bye so what i'm going to do is i'm going to park here but if you see here people are all you know with the restaurants and uh, everything is seeming with life which is so nice so what i'm doing is i'm just parking my bike here the bike parking is available here as well as in front and i'm going to show you guys in just a while let's just walk around and show you guys so just to show you see how many people are there all over the streets here ha uh ha -huh. uh -huh. okay so the pay parking is over here so uh, pay parking uh, for bus and tempo is 200 this is four wheelers is 100 two wheelers 50 rupees taxi is uh, 30 rupees and you can park for four hours if you are parking for more than four hours of course uh, the rates are mentioned there so those are the rules for here good morning bhaiya eta do minute so over here you have the big car parking area and of course uh the bike parking area is there that side as well and look at the shopping so they have quite a lot of shopping here but the magical thing about today is the sky guys look at that how beautiful is that so this is the parking area here if you want to you know come and park your vehicles here so tourist information center if you need the police or any help from the tourist police you can come here and also there is information center there so they give you all the complete information about whatever you require uh i i never showed you guys properly but there's a children's park here and if you see there is like swing slides everything so if you come with kids you know you should definitely take them in there and wow so good to see there are people back here so what we'll do is let's walk from the middle of the street <laughs> you know i'm making you guys feel you're walking down the street with me here so this is the famous car i better run because this uh, you know cars coming behind so this is the famous car here which you know most people broke sadly but yeah so this is where we came from the area there and this is the main entrance to the kandolim beach of course so what we'll do is let's go on to the kandolim beach entrance here and they open this gate i don't know why but yeah so that's the washroom there you can park here also if you want there's bike parking there and so much of interesting things that are here so if you see here they have all these bags and you know different things bags ka prices kya hai bhai ha kitna ha starting price kitna hai jhoot wala chahiye aapko 750 ka aayega ye 750 aur two number pad rehta hai 850 ka hai 850 450 how much 450 450 okay these are 450 and ye machine made mein aata hai 550 those are 550 those are machine made okay and glasses 150 100, 100 from 100 onwards so you have all these things here thank you so just to give you guys a idea of the prices here and you know let's walk on to the beach so this is the main beach entrance let's hopefully find some interesting things here wow the beach great information is coming out is that the shacks are being built up guys so cool so great news shacks are being built here so let's just go to the entrance and show you guys the you know uh, shacks that are being built up here wow i'm so happy okay so th this is the shacks that are being built up 
on both sides so if you see oh some of the shacks are already completely ready so that is amazing so these are like you know they have raised them up and made them really nice here but yeah let's just go around and check the scenes from here by the way guys uh, i would like to thank all of you who have sent me you know uh, the super thanks uh, i'm just putting your names here thank you for you know the uh, buy me a coffee here i really appreciate it so yeah let me just tell you guys the prices over here so this is the boating prices so parasailing is 1500 jet ski 600 bumper is 600 for two people banana boat 1500 uh 1800 okay so you guys saw the prices <laughs> okay so what we'll do is let's just go here and check out the scenes from here so as you can see there's international tourists there is uh the beach beds are back but let's just go and ask the prices of the beach beds right now but look at that guys so there's quite a lot of crowd here So if you see this over oh, against the light that's it let's just go here and show you guys so we'll try and see the crowd from this side so so many people here let's go and check out the water sports that is here wow. so water sports is here so they, these are the speed boats the speed boats take you from here and go all the way wow the water is so nice Let's just go walking around, hey, guys. Hey, got okay. So these are the water sports, guys. So yeah, so this is the boat that takes you, okay, and they take you all the way there for the parasailing. And as you can see, people are enjoying themselves. Wow, look at the water. So of course we'll go and check out the you know beach shacks and everything that is being built up. So just we'll go up here on the. side of the beach and show you guys the scenes from here so <laughs> they're taking the boats there but look here guys so here you have the shacks that are being built up and there's more shacks that are being built up over here as well so it looks like a nice beautiful day and look at the sky guys just giving you a complete tour around wow so there's so many people that's right but the beach shacks go all the way up till there and just let's take a little walk down the beach here and show you guys the shacks that are being built up so i expect within the week from when i uploaded this video all the shacks will be completely open and fully functional so if you see this so many people on the beach there's people swimming there by the way you guys always love my watches so i got a new watch today which is uh it's not a new watch it's a vintage uh seiko 5 so just to show you guys because i always get messages like if uh sorry <laughs> which watch am i wearing so wow i'm so happy guys you know shacks got delayed so much this year but it's so great to see that all the shacks are being completely done up but if you see every shack is completely different the style is uh, completely different and unique okay so i still didn't get them to ask them about the shack prices but the beach beds sorry not the shack prices but basically the beach beds prices here so there's mostly british tourists that are around here i can't turn around because of the you know light but uh i'm just going to take a little close up look here so if you see here there's all international tourists here and right till there in the distance all the shacks are being built up so what we'll do is let's go back now and show you guys the crowds from close up over there okay guys so we are at the other side of the beach i'm going to show you guys a bit of the crowd from here but there's quite a lot of international tourists that side but unfortunately it's against the light but just to give you guys a look so there are shacks all the way till sinkerem beach that side and 
what we have to do is we'll have to walk through the crowds this side but just to give you guys an update on the beach bed prices so the beach beds cost uh, 100 rupees per hour some of them will tell you for 200 rupees so if you come to the ones which is right at the entrance some of them will say 200 rupees but it is if you come to the ones further down it is 100 rupees and sometimes in future when you come and you're eating at the shacks uh, then you don't have to pay for the beach beds at some of the shacks so of course always ask them before so yeah so nice to see people you know swimming around here and let's just take a little walk into the water i'm just going to leave my slippers here we'll walk into the water here wow look at the waves wow so nice guys so yeah it's such a beautiful day the vibe is so nice my slippers are getting washed away so i have to run and get my slippers so i kept my slippers right here but the water is nice and cold so it's pretty cold the water compared to you know before ah go wow, guys just the vibe here how amazing is this so it's so nice to see people you know writing their names and everything into the sand here like i said so yeah guys so we made it back here and we'll just take a last look around and show you guys so uh, right up till there there are shacks and there is mostly international tourists at that end of the beach and the sinkerem side of the beach so they have jet skis there and all the water sports are operational here uh, the package here in kandalim is a little more expensive uh, compared to the other beaches so like if you go to anjuna beach or those sides that is a little cheaper for water sports but if you are taking the individual play packages then it's pretty good but if you are taking the water sports please make sure to come directly to the counter there and take it from there guys okay guys so just giving you some last scenes before we end the vlog just to give you guys a close up idea of what's happening here hey so this like people from all over here and i just wanted to give you guys a close up look of the shops here so you guys have an idea because you know when i go on the bike it's a little faster so you guys don't get to see as much as in detail but let's just look at the restaurant as well so this is hey hi how are you good yeah hi how are you how are you guys where are you from birmingham birmingham wow nice meeting you guys yeah take care bye bye see you so yeah so they're from birmingham so nice so yeah this is azura and this is the beauty of hi hi hello hi, hi guys how are you <laughs> good good oh so you are so you are you are right oh, right now on camera <laughs> we watch all oh. your videos really the wow we go to all these parts because of you wow so how long you guys in goa right now uh this is our second week we oh. go back next saturday How are you enjoying Goa right now? We love Beautiful. it. Yeah. Lovely. Is it hot or it's hot? Very hot. Yeah, really. It's, it's hotter than it's last hotter year. Than, yeah. Yeah. But okay. I mean, you guys are not used to it, so you know it's probably more hot for you guys. It is. Yeah. It is. Okay. So tell our viewers where you guys from exactly. We are from uh, London, Romford, Essex. Wow, so nice to see. So just how you guys were watching, somebody else in the world is watching right now. Your videos so, are very good. Your yeah. videos are really, really good. What are the places you have visited so far? Uh, we went to Palalum. Okay. Um, this year we went to Hampi. Okay. I know you haven't done a video no. on Hampi, but we've at most of the restaurants that you've that been you to. Really? Yes. So which one did you enjoy the most? Uh, we like the uh, Goan Hut. Okay. That was last year okay. when we came. Okay. But we need to try the one that you did this. I think this year or last year, where you were eating a massive lobster. Oh yes. <laughs> so that one is the uh, Palms and Sands in Kandalim here. Right, yeah, yeah. So you guys have to check it out. We went to Kalamari a few days ago. That was nice. Okay. So Palms and Sands is like two restaurants down from Kalamari. Oh, okay. okay. Yeah. Right. So lovely meeting you guys. Oh, Thank you very much. You too. Okay guys so those were our viewers from England now what we'll do is let's just go a little bit further on let me just take you guys around here and show you guys some more things over here so over here you have a salon just to show you like you know just inside here you have a small little salon 
and there's a lot of British tourists and international tourists who come to get their haircuts here. So if you see inside, I don't know if you can see inside. Hey, that's me. So yeah. So over here also, I'll just show you a few more places over here. So the, this is uh, yeah, like you know, the tours uh, available over here, and that's the salon that we just went to. That is Mr. Nice Salon, which is inside there. So these are the tour tour office and if you want to do water sports everything you can come and meet them so this is like uh, where you can holiday yeah holiday in goa is their name so they have like water sports uh, packages they have uh, houseboat packages everything possible here and these are the prices over here okay so that is the uh, shop from here thank you bye okay Aapka rate kya hai? Aapka hai? Oh, so this is the haircut shop so this is the mr nice salon so that's the guy from here super nice guy if you ever come come and meet him there are also tattoo studios here so yeah this is like if you want to get hair nails everything okay chalo, hai. so what we are going to do is it's super hot i'm going to sugar cane juice is there okay how much is the sugar cane juice 50, 50 rupees wow so let me get one sugar cane juice so you can get sugar cane juice here if you want to have some coconut water you can have coconut water here so just to show you guys like over here they have all the prices so the fruit juices everything so it's super hot so i'm going to have like a nice juice here hi so just to show you guys this is in Puerno here which is this restaurant and as you can see there's quite a few uh international tourists that are i think done with breakfast but let's just check the prices here so this is like the prices on the board here so just give you guys a close-up look at the prices of the bar you can just pause the video guys and you know you can see the prices like uh, the restaurant prices so you're here you have like the main course prices just a little close up and yeah so that gives you guys an idea of what is happening here what i'm going to do is let me get my juice because i'm super super thirsty and then yeah i'll show you when i get it okay guys so i got my sugarcane juice here super nice only 50 rupees look at the size so you can come and meet this gentleman here and what's your name of the shop huh smb s a what smb okay so we got the sugarcane juice let's have a nice sip wow nice and cold on a nice chilled uh yeah sorry it's nice and chilled on a nice hot day here in goa so yeah guys uh let's go a little further and show you some more so yeah guys just finished my uh sugarcane juice and just a last look at some of the shops here before we go back so i hope you enjoyed this vlog and you know i found it informative just last look here there's a little uh resort here which is called the holiday beach resort here if you want to stay very close to the beach okay guys so i met some more viewers of us over here so okay tell us where you are from where are you from i'm from bangalore okay so how long you been watching my videos uh, it's been more than three years okay. wow. i've been following you okay <laughs> and so how many places have you been to uh, i've been everywhere in goa okay. it's been like every year twice wow. twice we visit Okay. Twice a year we visit, and okay. we have been we have been checking your videos, and we plan our tour based on your recommendations. Wow, great! So here we have, yeah. What's your name? Uh, hi, my name is Nikita. Okay, yeah. Tell tell us about how you're enjoying Goa. Goa is lovely. It's okay. a you know beautiful place to stay in, and we feel very comfortable. Okay. You know, yeah, we are from Mumbai, but currently live in Bangalore, so we feel very comfortable in Goa. Everything is very good. Everything is very reachable. So you're enjoying now. Lovely. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so I'll just ask uh, more of, of our viewers here. So, hi, hi, where are you from? So, yeah. Hi, my name's Ray and we're from the UK, from York okay. in the UK. And we've been coming to Goa for more than 30 years. Okay, what do you enjoy the most about Goa? Uh, just the laid back atmosphere and uh, the beaches and everything. And uh, just, uh, we spend like four months here. Okay. So, so you enjoy my videos? I've been watching your videos for many years okay. uh, from the UK and then when we come we follow some of the trips that you've done also. Okay, so this is your wife? Yeah? Yes, I'm Sue. Yeah, okay. So, yes, tell us your name. I'm Sue. Okay, so you also enjoy Goa? I love the weather here, which is why we escaped from the UK cold winter. <laughs> <laughs> yes. 
yet. Okay, so a lovely meeting all of you. So yeah guys, it was lovely meeting so many of our viewers here. I kept on walking down the street. I met so many of you guys from all over the world. Thank you for watching this vlog. Please do like and subscribe and I'll be bringing you guys lots of other videos from here in Goa.